Topping our news tonight at 5, it's a summertime threat to uh, the health of you and your family. Local health experts say mosquito season is here, and that is prompting new fears about the potentially deadly West Nile virus. New at 5, 23 ABC's Christine Din with why doctors say they're expecting an explosion in cases this year. A mild winter, hot summer, and a drought are attracting more virus-carrying mosquitoes sooner than usual. Everybody in Kern County should take precautions. That's because residents have a higher chance of catching the West Nile virus this summer. Mosquitoes carrying West Nile have been found in 91 traps statewide, 25 of them in Kern County. Last year, at this time, we only had five positive traps. West Nile virus has appeared earlier than last year. Kern Mosquito and Vector Control Superintendent Gene Abbott says a mild winter, rising temperatures, and a drought are attracting more virus-carrying birds and mosquitoes. Anytime there's a drought, uh, mosquitoes need water, birds need water. This forces birds and mosquitoes into town. Which is where all of the West Nile-carrying mosquitoes have been found. All of the positive tracks so traps so far have been in town, uh, in the urban areas where we have uh, the sump water, the curb water, and where all the people are. Stagnant swimming pools are a primary breeding ground for West Nile. These pools can literally produce tens of thousands of mosquitoes from one swimming pool. It'll affect a whole neighborhood, just one swimming pool. In the past, pools at foreclosed homes were a major problem. But this year, more mosquito activity is being found in pools that are unserviced by homeowners. Abbott says many people are unable to afford keeping their pools serviced. So uh, I do expect to see more human cases this year than last year. Health officials say most people who are infected do not become ill. Some can. Most people who have mild illness will have, you know, a fever, um, maybe some nausea and vomiting, flu-like symptoms, and they'll get a rash. Um, those who are more serious can end up hospitalized and can end up with a meningitis. You can protect yourself by wearing protective clothing and mosquito repellent, especially during dawn and dusk, because that's when mosquito activity is highest. Now, so far, there are no cases of West Nile virus in humans. If you need help with getting your pool serviced because you cannot afford it, or if you need to report an unserviced pool that you may think has West Nile virus in it, you can call Vector Control at 589-2744. In the studio, I'm Christine Din, 23 ABC.